it would be great to have. But we wanted to show you the real instrument. There's people playing in the movie, doing all kinds of cool stuff. You saw the great list of songs that go by by the Beatles and Aerosmith and things like that. And unfortunately, because of music clearance rights, you can't buy all those songs to be in the movie. You can't play them all. So I thought I'd throw out a few pieces you might recognize played on Mellotron so you can hear it in person. And is everything still set up from before? Yes, we are. Let's listen to a few pieces. You'll know this one for sure. on the tape, which is strings. They have three violins playing together. And I'll put a little more reverb on it so you can hear another famous Melotron song. with the Moody Blues, great single, and almost all of it, in fact, is the Mellotron. It sounds like an orchestra, but they did a great job of replicating what an orchestra could do. Their keyboard player was extremely talented, and as they said in the film, he worked at the Mellotron Company. Uh, the string sound is really cool. You've heard it on David Bowie's Space Oddity. And the third sound I brought today is a choir sound, very popular with some progressive rock bands. And people like Radiohead and others have used it in modern days as well too, but it's, it's hard to avoid being somewhat pompous when you have the choir sound. It definitely has that kind of <laughs> air of, of fake sophistication, if you want to call it that. But we love the sound of the Mellotron, and I was going to do something uh, sit performance on the tickets and things, but I feel more like doing something that was inspired by Captain Beefheart. If you go to iTunes and type in Mellotron, see what pops up. There's a bunch of people that wrote songs called Mellotron that have zero Mellotron in them. I don't know why, because you can at least borrow or rent one sometime, but uh, Captain Beefheart has these things called Live Mellotron Improvisation, and I downloaded all of them, and it's just him going <laughs> for like five minutes of time, and I like that kind of stuff but most people don't. However, I figured I'd make up something kind of interesting and cool maybe with some of the effects we have here and live Mellotron and see what we can do with it.
Gilmore has come up, the director. Can you give me some questions? Okay, yeah. yeah. Does anybody um, have questions about the film 